the Digimon Twitter page has dropped their biggest tweet in recent memory. Oh, God. Hey. Which is this image of the Digimon Tamers D arc, with the teaser text reading, To all those who were Tamers 20 years ago. And the bottom reads, That excitement returns. And on January 31st is going to be a full reveal. But what exactly is it, and why? Does this mean a Tamers reboot? A follow up season? Some OVAs? A movie? Okay, I'm about to burst! It is in fact the 20th anniversary of Digimon Tamers, and when it was the 15th anniversary, they did make more D Arc Digivices in celebration of the 15th anniversary. So, naturally, 20th anniversary, they're doing the same thing. But at the same time, Digimon looks very different now. We're in an age where we have a Zero Two movie coming out, we've had Last Evolution Kazuna, Digimon Adventure reboot, and a complete new Digimon series in Digimon Ghost Game. Granted, it's a routinely product release, but clearly by the numbers on that tweet, the interest for Digimon Tamers has never been so high. And especially after the recent Konaka controversy, we won't talk about it, there is of course public outcry for just anything. But we're living in an era where the Digimon Vital Bracelet is vastly popular and in draws they're releasing dim card after dim card after dim card. It's been very successful, and I think that's a lot to do with the quality of the product you're getting, and how easy it is to consume. But the D arc is different, it's like an actual V pet, with all the inconveniences that that is unusually charming and makes people come back and want more. This day and age, if you've tried to collect these digivices from years ago, be it savers, be it tamers, be it zero or two, you're gonna spend a lot of money. Scalpers will have your life with these, so it is very good that they're making these again, but surely with the technology of the Vital Bracelet, is there really any excuse to not have a more advanced product? And it is premium Bandai, and you are going to pay a lot of money for these digivices regardless of whether you're being scalped or being sold at on market price. Tamers fans just have to fork out, sadly. But my expectations for the new D-Arc for the 20th anniversary in this day and age, I don't see why it shouldn't have all the upgrades and all the amazing colourful features that kind of go with the vital bracelet, really. Could it be the first domino that falls in that in the next few years we get more things for Digimon Tamers as we have had the announcement of a Zero Two movie, which absolutely nobody expected. After Kizuna, nobody expected that at all. I'm really excited and looking forward to seeing what they're going to present to us on the 31st of January. And I appreciate the D-Arc is for the die-hard fans, you know, it's not for new Digimon fans really. But I do hope that this D-Arc is simply just the aesthetics of the Tamers Digivice and not literally catered to all the Tamers fans out there as much as a lot of you might like that because the reality is a lot of the new Digimon fans that may or may not buy into the franchise won't have watched Tamers. It's a very old show, much like Adventure and Zero Two. They're probably not going to commit and watch that series as it's so old, so having this new D arc being catered to just Tamers only viewers is kind of isolating a huge audience. It should be very general and very easy to use. But you know, this could mean anything. This could really mean anything. This could be the start of something huge where each individual series in the franchise is getting its own little bump so all the viewers can be happy. Whichever series is your favourite, you can be happy, you're going to get something. Or is it purely just the routinely paying homage to a series anniversary that has just passed? You decide. But I'll make more content on this topic on the 31st of January. So make sure you come back on this channel for then. Thank you for watching this short discussion. Please like, comment and subscribe. Support me anywhere you see fit. But most importantly, take care.